So the question gives us a square base pyramid, a side length 20 centimeters, and the angle between any side and the square base is 55 degrees. So what this means is it, the angle is, is if I drop this down to the center of the square and this to the midpoint. So this is 90 degrees, and the one we're interested in, the 55 degrees, is here. So the surface area is going to be the area of the base plus four sides. This is a five mark question. Let's start off, pick up the easy mark, the area of the base. And this is going to be 20 squared, and that's 400 square centimeters. Next one we've got to work out is the area of the side of the one side. And what we need to do here is we need to find Vm. So this is Vxm. We know this is 55 degrees. It's a right angle triangle. So Xm is 10 centimeters. It's half the side length. And we need to find this length here. So this is the hypotenuse that we need to find. And we've got an adjacent angle, so we're going to use cos. So it's going to be cos 55 degrees equals adjacent 10 over the hypotenuse Vm. And this means Vm equals 10 cos divided by cos 55 degrees, which is going to be 17.4 three four centimeters. Now we've got a triangle BCV like this. This is B C V. B C is twenty centimeters because it's a square sided triangle and we found this height here because this is M. The area of the side is going to be half base times height, half the base is half times 20 times Vm, which is the 17.434. So that's 10 times that, so 174.34 centimeters squared. And if we now go back to the surface area calculation, then the surface area is going to be 400 plus 4 times 17, sorry, 174.34, and that adds up to 1097.4 centimeters squared. So two significant figures, that's 1100 centimeters squared. That's the answer. So an estimate of the mark scheme will be one mark for finding the area of the base. That's a nice easy mark to pick up. It'll be a mark for finding the slant height Vm using that to find the area of one side. Combining the base area and four of the sides to find the surface area and then the final mark will be giving it to two significant figures.